one or the other, or is it kind of like a parallel and you do both at one time, yeah. or how does that work? Well, our first, our, the first six, uh, we're doing it, we're doing parallel stories, so we're following both of them at once and cutting in between them. I know there were a couple you served in the class. Uh, when you first mentioned that you met Rick, you referred to the stories as screenplays. Was it when you, did you write them as a different medium, or were they meant to be? Comedy? They were. They, they were both TV pilots, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I I originally um I originally had Berserker as a in mind for television, and um, little did I know you can't rip a man's arm off and beat him with it. <laughs> better medium for this story and it's not something that uh, initially I would have uh, I would have thought of but Milo saw it right away and honestly that's and it's also you know Top Cow also is a you know a home for it. It really this specific story I think really is a Top Cow story. Yeah. Also the pilot you know, it didn't really have like I mean it had a beginning but it didn't really have an ending. It just kind of was open ended and it kind of kept on going. It wasn't like a traditional screenplay that you would read. It was uh, there's a lot of like description. I mean, have you ever read like a Tarantino screenplay where it's more like a book? It's like a, like 200 pages and there's like a lot of description and stuff like that. So it's not like a classic like 45 page pilot. It was like a lot denser than that. Just you know. Rick likes to write a lot, is what he's saying. Yeah, <laughs> a lot. Yes, sir. Hey,